Kathy Lames here from Living Attributes and welcome to my series Know Yourself, Discover Your Purpose. This week we're going to be looking at the light attribute of integrity. It's one of my favourite words actually and I think that's because Without integrity, we can't trust each other. Without integrity, we don't know where we sit in the world, in fact. You know, we don't know who's telling us the truth, or we don't know whether we're telling ourselves the truth. We have to find our own integrity so that we can see integrity in others. So the healer is in actual fact the archetype in this system that has the attribute of integrity. Which makes sense that you know you'd want to you'd want to connect with a healer who has integrity, right? So integrity uh, and the shadow side of that, of course, though, is dishonest. So uh, for me, when I'm feeling out of integrity with myself, or when I'm faced with people who are demonstrating that they're out of integrity with them, their self or our relationship, uh, I can feel really victimized, which of course is the persistent obstacle of the healer. Uh, not that I'm a healer, but you know, I'm just demonstrating to you the, the pain that the healer could go through. But the true metaphor, the true metaphor of the healer is resurrection. They're a bit like the phoenix rising out of the ashes, you know, facing their depths of despair around feeling like they're the victim, you know, feeling like they're totally out of integrity, but rising up out of that until they are a full integral being again. So integrity is an amazing word, integral, you know, making something whole um, is a wonderful thing. And, you know, no doubt we actually need that on the planet now is for people to be more in, in integrity with themselves and in integrity with our planet so that we are an integral organism together, that we can heal ourselves and our planet. So March is the month of the healer. So I invite you to celebrate that, that the healer, uh, healers around you, the healer within you, the healers that have been in your life. And I also encourage you to celebrate the animal wisdom of the bee, a gorgeous little busy bee who's productive, who's absolutely always on purpose, providing honey, providing nutrition for us as humans and um, very focused, you know, a very focused little creature who's always on purpose. So we can learn a lot from the bee around being in integrity with yourself and your environment. So this month I encourage you to look at your own integrity. Look at the healers around you. Perhaps look at the productivity of the bee and maybe even look at the shadow of um, the shadow of integrity, which is dishonesty, and also the the shadow or the persistent obstacle uh, of the healer, which is to feel victimized or to be surrounded by that victim mentality. And know though that the true quest of the healer is to resurrect, to be a radiant being and resurrect yourself up out of the ashes. So I look forward to seeing you again next week and bye for now.